The officer breaks into a car to rescue the baby, then realized he made a terrible mistake. You might think you would never forget your child in the back, but it can happen to anyone. Busy schedules, lack of sleep, and changes in routine can distract us easier than you think. No child should ever be left unattended in a vehicle for any amount of time, even a quick trip into the store is too long. Accidents happen, and 33% of children who die from being left in a hot car are less than one year old. Leaving children unattended in a vehicle for even a few minutes can be risking their life. Per reports, the 911 caller told the dispatcher that they spotted a baby left alone in a car. The call prompted the police officer to rush to the Walmart shopping plaza. There, just as the call had said, he spied an infant in a car, a blanket, a bottle, and finally two bare feet, motionless, emerging from beneath the fabric. He drew his baton, smashed the window, and saved the child. Something was wrong. He described the infant as appearing lifeless or dead. Officer Short began administering CPR. It did not work. He called for an ambulance, and then he checked for an obstructed airway. He then realized that the baby was, in fact, a realistic-looking doll and that its mouth did not open. He canceled the call for an ambulance. When the brave officer found the owner of the doll, Seifert, who was getting her hair cut in supercuts during the incident, she told the officer that it was designed to look as much like a real baby as possible. He said the doll even felt like a real baby when he picked it up. The woman told the officer that she had purchased the doll, named Ainsley from a doll nursery for $2,300 the week before the incident. The doll called a reborn doll is handcrafted from silicone so it looks as realistic as possible. Seifert has a collection of reborn dolls. She says she plans to put a sticker on her car to alert others that the babies inside the car are not real.